the only lonely panda. Deep in the dewy forest, where flamingos danced and butterflies fluttered, panda sat alone. I wish I had a friend. He sighed. Then panda saw her. Wowie! Look, maybe she'll be my friend. But panda didn't know how to make friends. I wonder what the other animals do. He thought. Graceful flamingos made friends by dancing together. That's it! Panda exclaimed. I will dance, like a fluffy flamingo. Then the panda will be my friend. What? How could anything possibly go wrong? Oof! Down on the ground, Panda spotted two blue-footed boobies. Aha! He said, "I'll stump and strut like a booby. Then we will be friends." Now, where did she go? But Panda hadn't looked very far before. He spotted a handsome peacock. Feathers! Panda ooped. If I had a dazzling tail, she'd surely be my friend. All I need is one or two. Yikes! Sorry. Phew! Panda puffed. Who needs fancy feathers anyway? Panda picked up some bamboo and waggled his bottom. This tail waggle will surely succeed. Here we go. Poop. Panda sighed. She will never ever be my friend. And he plodded off to get his dinner. Deep in the dewy forest, where flamingos danced and peacocks pranced, Panda sat eating alone. But not for long. Oh, hello," said the other panda. "That looks tasty. It's crummy," nodded Panda. And then he had his best idea yet. Would you like to share? And so they did. Among the lush leaves, two pandas ate and played together, and became the best of friends. The end.